Hello everyone, so today I want to talk about uh, script fields and uh, I want to talk about uh, how to perform search using JQL when you are using uh, scripted fields. Now if you take a look at uh, my Jira instance, um, I have a field here called comment count. So it is of course a very simple field which is showing the count of comments and if I go to one of my Jira issue. You can see here that for each and every issue where of course this field is added, it will tell you the comment count. So right now it is one and if I want I can of course add one more command like something like this and uh, I can take a look at uh, uh, so this field of course will be updated with two. I can add maybe one more one more comment and uh, uh, it will now be three, which is good. Now, what if you want to search based on this particular field? So let us say you want to search for all those issues where comment count is equal to three or more than three. So you can, of course, try using JQL, but right now there is no field called comment count. Now there is a reason for that. If you look at the comment field, it is using a searcher which is number, number searcher. So if you click on let us say the edit of this particular field, you can uh, see the template here which is the number field, which is fine, it is a number field. But there is also one more thing that you need to do, you need to go to the custom fields and uh, you need to also change the, if you go to the edit of comment count. Uh, you need to change the search template to number because it is a number field and if you now by the way you might need to you will need to perform re-indexing so you can uh, perform it uh, so you can click on maybe full re-index it is my local instance so I can do that without worrying about uh, the downtime so it will probably take maybe few seconds because it is not really a massive instance of Jira and once my reindexing is finished, I'll click on refresh a couple of times. So it is done now. I'll go back to my issue navigator and I will search for the field again. And let us see if we can use the field. So if I now try to search for the field, I can use it now in the JQL. Now I can uh, do something like this greater than or equal to maybe 3 and I can search for it and it will now show me all the issues where the comment count is more than 2 or 3 or whatever. So basically you need to modify the template and you also need to modify the search template when you have to perform search based on uh, the script fields. And uh, this is all I wanted to share in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.